I said, you know, if, if, if unless something changes, next season is going to be my last season. And then finally I realized, I said, wait, well, you can't make this decision based off of something changing. This is something that's internal. Do you want to do this or not? And if the answer is no, then that passion is no longer there the way it used to be. So just let it go. I just want to congratulate you on an unbelievable career. I think uh, when I look back, and the first time we actually played against each other, the competitive drive that I saw within your eyes, even though the knowledge wasn't quite there yet, um, it was very invigorating. And I'm very happy to, to, uh, to leave you this message to say how much you know, we are very proud of what you've accomplished over the years. Um, the most people don't realize you were drafted by Charlotte Hornets, uh, so that you know, connects us with you. Um, I've always been you know, like a big brother and you're like a little brother. We communicate all the time. I just want to say congratulations. You know, your next step in your next career is going to be something that I'm pretty sure you're going to have to figure out you know, from a competitive standpoint. I'm pretty sure you're just like me. Uh, you're going to have to find other ways to utilize that competitive job. But, I want to congratulate you and Vanessa and the girls. Uh, you've been a big help to the game of basketball. You helped the NBA, uh, you helped promote it. Uh, I'm pretty sure you got a lot of fans all over the world. Uh, I'm a big fan, I still love watching you play. I'm, I'm very, very happy for you and what you've accomplished within the game. And uh, I look forward to seeing what you do next. If you ever need me, you know my number, let's stay in touch. I wish you the best and have a great game tonight, not too good of a game. Uh, but I want you to stay healthy, as I said a couple weeks ago.